Okay, guys, let's have a go at 19 then. We've got this integral here. 2e to the x sine x cosine x. It's not difficult to see. We can use a double angle formula. So we write this as a simple product of e to the x, and it will be sine 2x, wouldn't it? Double angle formula. Okay, so uh, v du or u to v. Uh, v. I'm going to do it the other way around, if that's okay. V uh, du. So let's do that then. And see what we get. So v equals sine 2x. And du is equal to e to the x. So to v is equal to cos 2x two lots of. And then u is equal to e to the x, isn't it? So i equals then. Uh, what have we got? We've got uv e to the x sine 2x minus the integral of u to v, which will be 2. Put that at the front, e to the x cos 2x dx. Now I can circle that, e to the x cos 2x there, and let that equal j. Draw a line across the page and put j equals. Draw my grid to work out this integral. Um, e to the x cos 2x, what did we do? We did, so that would be v, wouldn't it? And that would be du. So v equals cos 2x, uh, du is e to the x, so dv will be um, minus sine 2x times 2, and u will equal e to the x. So uv, that one, e to the x cos 2x, right, minus the integral of u to v. There's a minus there, makes that a plus. The 2 can come to v at the front, all right? And then it's e to the x sine 2x dx. And that's just back to i, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so draw a line across the page and do the final part then. So i equals, what have we got? We've got e to the x sine 2x minus 2 lots of j. And j is e to the x cos 2x plus 2i. Great. Close bracket. Okay. That's what we got then. So let's just close that. That's what i equals. Plus a k at the end, of course. Right. So let's just tidy that up and move things around. Yeah. So we're going to have the minus 2 times plus 2 is minus 4i. So I'm going to move that over there to be with the i to make 5i. The e to the x I'm going to keep outside the bracket. And inside the bracket will be sine 2x. And the second one will be minus uh, 2 cos 2x. Yeah? Plus rk. And then we can now... Oops. I'll just move that up the page. Oops. Get a bit of a mess here. So let's just move that up to there. And then we'll do i. It's e to the x over 5, sine 2x minus 2, cosine 2x plus k. There we go. That's uh, question 19 done. Good. Let's go on to the next one then. Great.